to testing mushrooms for computers. To explore this, the team grew shiitake mushrooms and button mushrooms on organic materials such as wheat germ, hay, and farro seeds. Once the fungal mats reached maturity, they were dried in sunlight to maintain shape and later sprayed with water to restore conductivity. Quote, we would connect electrical wires and probes at different points on the mushrooms because distinct parts of the it have different electrical properties, said Larocco. At specific frequencies, the mushroom displayed classic memory loops known as hysteresis curves. On confirming their potentials as memorizers, mushrooms that remember the resistance in their tissue changed predictably, which allowed scientists to write and erase memory states, which means they could store information on it and do processes with it. This behavior confirmed that the fungi could act as living hardware for neuromorphic systems where data storage and processing happen together. The simplicity of cultivation and testing means future researchers might experiment with homegrown versions of their technology without large facilities.